Welcome back to Lake Life Consultants. It is Ramon checking in with you guys. I know it's been quite a while, but to be quite honest, over the last couple of months, Brittany and myself were preparing for our wedding down in Fayetteville, Tennessee. We officially made it official on May 26, 2024. But we've come back to the house and we are pushing full steam ahead with renovations. We finished up the living room and painted it in Sherwin-Williams sea salt. Um, only thing remaining is, of course, the trim on the windows and the door uh, to be painted white as well as some touch-ups where we overpainted, but that was intentional or lack of caring because it would be painted anyway. Uh, but this is where we're at. So walls are done, living room is done. Of course, the floors are going to be last. We, we did that intentionally because when you refinish floors, you got a bunch of sawdust coming up and we didn't want to have to wipe everything down to then paint after the fact. Uh, hallway is coming up today, actually. We'll be doing uh, some screen molding to marry the beadboard to the walls, as well as a flat coffered style effect in the hallway with one by fours and cove molding. We finished up the bedroom. The bedroom came out amazing. So we did a topiary tint in the bedroom and a wainscoting effect with one by fours. Um, we also did a flat coffered style look on the ceiling. Uh, it's all one by four trim along with cove molding. As you can tell, it came out absolutely glorious. The key to this, guys, the key, the absolute key to everything when doing DIY is learning that prep is worth the time it takes to actually get it done. You know, a lot of uh, caulking went in place um, to make it look nice and neat and organized. And yeah, but it came out absolutely beautiful. We also opened up this wall that used to be closed because it was a second bathroom in the house. So now we'll have an ensuite bathroom. The next project is going to be closing this out, setting it up with racks for towels and toiletries. And we'll make videos of that as we do it. That door we'll be replacing as well with a full glass built-in blind door. But our bedroom, man, <laughs> can I just say, we cannot wait to get our new bed that's coming in with an antique style bed frame and have this view of our backyard where we extensively garden and we kind of take on a lot of projects at once you know so we have a bunch of stuff to get organized back there but at this point the bedroom really just has the bedroom doors to be painted and the trim to be retouched, but yeah, we're moving full steam ahead. We want to say thank you to you guys for following, uh, supporting us and allowing us to share our journey with you. It's been our pleasure, honestly, from the bottom of our hearts. We also are looking forward to showing you the journey with redoing our kitchen, which we're going to do from top to bottom and documented. And if you guys are into BMWs or cars for any given reason, feel free to follow our other channel, which is Lake Life Beamers, L-A-K-E, Lake Life, L-I-F-E, Beamers, B-I-M-M-E-R-S. So Lake Life Beamers, where we document and also showcase our vehicles. We have a 2009 BMW 650i, lovingly named Annie because Anakin, right? All dark. We have Fernie, a 2005 330 CI E46. And we have Blue, a 2002 uh, BMW 525 IT touring wagon. Uh, we might possibly actually uh, pick up a new project, a 2007 535XI N54 E60 BMW that we'll be documenting as we go through all the process of updating it, turbo upgrades, so on and so forth. But look forward to following up with you guys. Once again, thank you for following, you know, supporting us, keeping along with everything. 
and look forward to giving you more videos as we come along. Talk to you guys soon.